Welcome to the Gateway of the Philippines, Manila. Before we dive into the breathtaking islands, let's set the stage with this vibrant city. Known as the Pearl of the Orient, Manila is a bustling metropolis where history meets modernity. Here, Spanish colonial churches stand side by side with towering skyscrapers. From the historic Intramuros to the lively markets of Quiapo, Manila offers a unique blend of old and new. And don't forget to indulge in the local cuisine. Filipino food is a rich tapestry of flavors, combining indigenous traditions with Spanish, American, and Chinese influences. So before we explore the sun-soaked islands, take a moment to experience the heart and soul of the Philippines right here in Manila. This is just the beginning of our epic journey. Now let's head to our first island destination. As we journey through the stunning landscapes and thrilling adventures of the Philippines, let's take a moment to savor the rich culinary traditions that this country has to offer. The Filipino cuisine is a delightful blend of indigenous flavors, with influences from Spanish, Chinese, and American cultures. Picture yourself strolling through a bustling local market, the air filled with the aroma of sizzling street food. Start your culinary adventure with a taste of adobo, a savory dish made with marinated meat, simmered in a blend of soy sauce, vinegar, garlic, and spices. Each region has its own unique twist on this classic Filipino staple. Next, indulge in Lashan, a succulent roasted whole pig, known for its crispy skin and tender meat. It's a dish often reserved for special celebrations, and one bite will show you why it's so beloved. Don't miss out on the vibrant and refreshing Halo Halo, a popular dessert perfect for cooling down in the tropical heat. This colorful concoction features a mix of shaved ice, sweet beans, fruits, jellies, and topped with a scoop of creamy ubi ice cream. It's a feast for the eyes and the taste buds. For the more adventurous eaters, balut, a fertilized duck egg, is a must-try. This unique delicacy is enjoyed with a pinch of salt and a dash of vinegar, offering a taste of Filipino tradition that dates back centuries. From the savory to the sweet, the culinary treasures of the Philippines are as diverse and vibrant as its landscapes. So, as we continue our journey, let's remember to savor the flavors and celebrate the rich culture that makes the Philippines truly special. Now let's dive into our island tour and discover why this place is called Paradise. Welcome to Paradise. Number 10 on our list stop is the Hundred Islands National Park in Alaminos, Pangasinan. This national park boasts 124 islands during low tide, each with its unique charm. Go island hopping, snorkeling, or kayaking, and discover the natural beauty and rich marine life of this fantastic destination. At number 9 we found ourselves at Oslob in Cebu. This place is known for one thing, whale sharks. These gentle giants are absolutely mesmerizing to swim with. They're huge, like, seriously huge, but they're completely harmless. It's a truly humbling experience. But Oslob's got more than just whale sharks. The beaches here are pristine, the water's crystal clear, you can literally walk out of your hotel room and straight into paradise. It's the perfect spot to chill out and soak up the Filipino sun. At our number 8, we're heading to the Cuyo Islands in Palawan. This place is all about escaping the hustle and bustle of city life. Think laid-back vibes, serene beaches, and a taste of traditional Filipino culture. We're talking about exploring hidden coves, kayaking through mangroves, and experiencing life at a slower pace. Cuyo is a place where you can truly disconnect and reconnect with yourself. Next at 7 we head to the Kamotes Islands in Cebu. Often referred to as the Lost Horizon of the South, these islands are perfect for those seeking tranquility and natural beauty. With stunning caves, beautiful beaches, and lush landscapes, the Kamotes Islands offer a perfect blend of adventure and relaxation. Kamotes Islands offer it all. Think untouched beaches, crystal clear water, with its natural beauty. We did not forget about local fishing villages, fresh seafood, and a pace of life that'll make your Apple Watch feel redundant. This is where you go to unplug, recharge, and remember what it means to just be. Countdown number 6 we found ourselves at Siargao known as the surfing capital of the Philippines, is our next destination. Famous for its cloud 9 waves, Siargao attracts surfers from around the globe. But there's more to Siargao than surfing, explore the stunning lagoons, hidden caves and pristine beaches that make this island a must-visit the surfing capital of the Philippines. This place is all about good vibes, even better waves, and a community that's as welcoming as the ocean itself. Whether you're a seasoned pro or a complete beginner, Siargao's got a wave with your name on it. But it's not just about surfing, this island is overflowing with natural beauty, from lush jungles to crystal clear waters. Fifth on our list is Panglao Island in Bohol. 
Known for its white sandy beaches and crystal clear waters, Panglao is a haven for divers and beach lovers. Visit the Hinagdanan Cave, explore the vibrant coral reefs, or simply relax and soak up the sun on Alona Beach. This place is like the poster child for Philippine beaches, we're talking white sand that squeaks between your toes, water so clear you can see your own reflection, and diving spots teeming with life. I swear, I saw more fish in one dive here than I've seen in my entire life, and the vibe? Super chill. Imagine sipping fresh coconut water under a palm tree, watching the sunset paint the sky in a million colors. Panglao is pure paradise. Our next stop at number 4 is the unique Pink Beach on Great Santa Cruz Island in Zamboanga. The beach gets its pink hue from crushed red organ pipe coral mixed with white sand. This stunning and rare beach offers a unique experience for those looking to witness one of nature's beautiful anomalies. It's like something out of a dream, this pink sand stretching as far as the eye can see. And the underwater world? Just as vibrant. We snorkeled for hours, surrounded by colorful fish and coral reefs. This place is proof that nature is the ultimate artist. Takao Island in Masbait is our third destination. Known for its pristine waters and rich marine biodiversity, Takao Island is a paradise for divers. Explore the famous manta bowl, swim with manta rays, and discover the island's stunning waterfalls and unspoiled beaches. It's all about raw, untouched beauty and incredible marine life. But the highlight? Swimming with manta rays. These gentle giants are absolutely mesmerizing. We spent an entire afternoon snorkeling alongside them, watching them glide effortlessly through the water. It's an experience I'll never forget, and a reminder of how important it is to protect our oceans. Two on our list are the Balabac Islands in Palawan. These remote islands are known for their powdery white sand beaches, crystal clear waters, and diverse marine life. Visit the famous Onuk Island, explore the lush mangroves, or simply relax in this untouched paradise. We're diving deep into the Philippines and this place, Balabac Islands, is straight out of a dream. Think crystal clear turquoise water, white sand that feels like powdered sugar, and untouched nature. It's remote, it's wild, it's the kind of place where you can truly disconnect and just soak in the beauty. We're talking about swimming with sea turtles, spotting exotic birds, and just feeling the energy of a place that hasn't been overrun by tourists. This is the Philippines at its most raw and most beautiful. Our number one is Apo Island. This small volcanic island is famous for its marine sanctuary and is a top destination for snorkelers and divers. Swim with the turtles, explore the vibrant coral reefs, and enjoy the island's pristine beaches and laid-back vibe. This place is a testament to what happens when people protect the ocean. This community-managed marine sanctuary is a shining example of how to do conservation right. The coral reefs here are teeming with life, the fish are plentiful, and the whole vibe is one of harmony between humans and nature. It's inspiring to see a place where fishing is sustainable, where the ecosystem is thriving, and where the locals are leading the way in protecting their slice of paradise. This is what hope looks like, people. That's it for our Philippine adventure. We just explored 10 of the most incredible places this country has to offer. If you're looking for stunning beaches, vibrant culture, and some serious natural beauty, the Philippines is calling your name. Thank you for exploring the top 10 most beautiful places in the Philippines with us. Don't forget to leave a comment, like, share this video, and subscribe for more amazing content. See you in the next adventure.